Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how to automate Wondershare Filmora with Macro Recorder to automatically extract frames from a video clip. So let's get started. I will use this simple countdown video clip to show the necessary steps. My goal is to export a frame every second. After downloading the file, add it to the timeline. In case you don't know how to do it, I made a video on how to download a video. Check out my channel if you want. The snapshot command in Filmora can be used to extract a frame at the current playback position. There is even a hotkey for that. Another thing to automate is the movement of the playhead. Press shift plus right cursor key to advance the playhead one second. The preview window already shows the correct frames I want to save automatically. Since this is a countdown video, I want to save the frames in reverse order, which is fortunately very easy in Filmora. Now that the video is in correct order, run Macro Recorder. I am going to set the window always on top by using a script. If you want to know more about that script leave a comment below. Now, Macro Recorder will stay on top even when Filmora is activated. When automating things, it is recommended to use the focus window command to ensure that the automation is performed on the correct window. Press OK to add the first action. The next command to automate is the snapshot command, which is triggered by a hotkey. Macro Recorder supports hotkeys. The application will resolve and add the appropriate single keys. In the beginning, it makes sense to use the wait command frequently. Once a script runs reliably, the wait time can be adjusted or the wait command can be deleted. Use the hotkey command to add complex hotkeys. Press the hotkey on your keyboard and press OK. I prefer to test immediately. Why wait and not have fun right away? Press play to run the script. Great. The script is working so far. Enter or return should be the next command added to close this dialog. But first, I'll add a little wait command. Press Enter, then OK. To move the playhead we are going to add the hotkey as shown at the beginning of the video. Press Shift plus right cursor. Add another weight for fun. Testing time, hooray! Awesome! It worked! The frame has been saved, and the playhead has been moved by one second. It couldn't be better. Now, we want to enter a loop command. Select Start from the drop-down menu. Repeat the procedure for 120 seconds. This should be enough to finish the task. Before we optimize the script, let's try it again. You never know. Fantastic. Looks good. Everything is running. This wait command can probably be omitted, but I am keeping it for now and set the wait time to 100. I will also lower these values. That should make the script faster. This script is ready. The play hit still needs to be set to start. Somewhere here. Last but not least, open the output folder. OK, let's run this and see how it turns out. Perfect. Let's speed this up a bit.
Great, all 100 snapshots have been created correctly. I saved a lot of time, thanks to automation. So that was the video on how to automate Filmora with Macro Recorder. I would like to mention that there are easier ways and tools to save single frames. But here, I was interested in automating a task with Macro Recorder. Thanks for watching. See you next time.